James Kaufman, World News Report Today. Today is February 9th, 2023, noon central here in the U.S. God bless you and yours, no matter where you are in the world. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. You see here that NOAA has named all the M flares that have occurred over the last 50, 60 hours, almost three day period. Now they did actually miss this one M flare here, which is barely an M1.0. However, it shows that we have been hit by 12 M flares in the last three days, I would suggest 13. And it actually talks about the chances of an X flare today. Let's take a look at the story, then we'll take a look at the sunspots. There's an increasing chance of flares per NOAA. The odds of a strong solar flare today have more than doubled in response to a sudden profusion of large sunspots. NOAA forecasters say that there is a 55% chance of an M-class solar flare today and a 15% chance of an X-class solar flare today. The most likely source is the Earth-facing sunspot AR-3213, which has an unstable delta-class magnetic field. Now that was per NOAA, but we have found out today already that the chances of an M flare are 100% and that most of them would be generated by the newly named sunspot that's just come around the limb, AR3217. Let's take a look at the sunspots. I will say that a 15% chance of an X flare over today is a pretty good chance. Then given a 55% chance of an M flare was a joke because we've already had four or five of them, depending on how you look at it. So, 3213 is the culprit that they're calling out, but 3217 over here is responsible for four of the five M flares so far today. You can see that many of the sunspots on the sun have become much more complex. You can see the positive and negative embryos overlapping. And I see at least four, maybe five sunspots here that are capable of producing strong solar flares. Fingers crossed. Remember, Noah told us that the M6 flare did not produce a chrome mass ejection because it was earth facing and was coming from 3213 yesterday. God bless you and yours. Share and subscribe. And let's hope that all these sunspots transverse our solar disk and that Earth gets away with no major hits over the next week. Although things are supposed to get worse as we go into March. God bless you and yours. Share and subscribe. And always remember that anything's possible in the bizarro world.